Hey there, so in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can use SQLite to create a database for your application. This is very small size database. If you try to download the Windows version, you will find that it is merely 300 KB of database. Once downloaded, you can find that you will have one executable file here which you can access from command prompt and you can write the queries okay so let's open command prompt and let me type sqlite3 okay you will find that the version here shows 3.8.8.1 and you can type help to get the commands that you can use now let's just type by default anything that you create will be stored inside database called main so type dot databases and you will find there is a database called main now you can use this existing database or you create your own by typing sqlite on name of your database something like sales db so after that let's just create a table create table company inside which use id integer primary key not no then name text not no and age integer not no can create this table on main database and this table is created now type tables to check the number of tables in your database so you'll find that there is a company table and you can now execute select command select stop from company will show you if there are any records on your database but as of now we didn't add any records so it will not generate any listing so let's add something like sort into company which id name age values will be one then within quotes name is Alan then age B22 and we're gonna close it let's just change the value this time to 2 Paul change to 32 okay let's have one more likewise we will create up to three to four okay okay now go to the end and hit enter okay let's have one more four then you have something like Jeff it's it should be 33 okay. now we have our four entries here let's check out if we can see our company data okay so it shows you table that there are four records and it shows exactly the way we added into the data now what if I want to update this data I will type update company and we're gonna set let's say name 
equals to Joe where ID equals to let's say three. I will find that the update is now taken. So we have our third record updated to the main Joe. Likewise, we can use a few more commands as well. What if I want to delete a particular record? In that case, let's just type delete from company where ID equals four. Give it a semicolon and hit enter. And now let's run select command again. You find that third record doesn't exist anymore. So this was pretty much about how you can create a table, insert values, update values from table, delete records, and also selecting all the records and showing you the data so now what we have to do is if i want to remove this entire table then there is a command called drop just type drop table company and your entire table will be removed okay so let's hit enter and you'll find that there is no table anymore so if you have databases it shows no files in here because all the data is stored in main which is a transient database which you can see here transient in memory database so it will not store your data here so this was a simple introduction to SQLite. In future tutorials, I will show you some of the administration tools like Navigat's SQLite tool uh, to manipulate the databases. I hope you find this tutorial helpful. If you have any questions, have any queries, then feel free to let me know in the comments. And thanks for watching.